What's up, my beautiful people? Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Johnson Joy. I'm here again with another video. So before I get into today's video, I'd like to say let's make this channel popular. If you're not subscribed to my channel, please kindly click on the red subscribe button and also on the bell sign so you would be notified anytime I upload a new video. If you're a new, um, if you're coming across my channel for the first time or you are a returning um, viewer, if not subscribed, please, the subscribe button doesn't bite and it's just so free to subscribe. Just click on the subscribe button also and also on the bell sign. So today's video is about Mr. Bean. I'm sure you guys um, have seen the title, you've seen the thumbnail, but you might be wondering, oh, when did this happen and how did it happen? So it's about um, a Pakistani man that scams Zimbabwe after faking to be Mr. Bean. Some citizens of Zimbabwe got scammed. After a Pakistani imposter posed as popular actor Mr. Bean. You guys are already seeing the video. You can see the man in the video. According to report, the country in 2016 had an encounter with this man who looked exactly like popular British actor Rowan Atkinson. Due to his striking resemblance, the whole nation thought he was Mr. Bean and they started addressing him as such until he left the country. It went on to say that some organizers even made him host a show that sold out in the country because they all thought he was the original um, man. He thought he was the original uh, person. The fake Mr. Bean was given police escort in a car. I'm sure you guys are seeing it and you can even see crowd. When drove through principal street of the capital, Harare. I hope I'm pronouncing that well. Zimbabwe lived in the streets to have a glimpse of the man they always see on the television as he also waved them and enjoy all the glory you can see that look at the crowd imagine people thinking <laughs> he's the real person it was later they got to know that he was actually a fake person and an imposter he used his head to enjoy from the people of zimbabwe you can imagine this is really really very very funny and imagine the old crowd the police escort imagine their efforts imagine the money that they've lose and you know if it was me too i would think he's the real person and i would even come out i i don't know if the show was actually something people would pay like, you know, when all those comedians want to have their show in Nigeria, I don't know how Zimbabwe is, and I don't know how they organize the show. You know, they will actually rent it all or rent somewhere, and you need to pay gate fee to come in to, to see the, to, to, to watch the show. You understand? So, only God know how much people had actually lose. Imagine, look at the cars and everything. They, they painted it, and I'm sure they painted it exactly when, you know, the, he, 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 he wanted to come and <laughs> do his thing. Now, wow, it's not easy, eh? You know, people around the world are trying to survive. So this man is even trying to survive. The real Mr. Bean is about 66 years old as of this year, according to what I saw on the internet. So he's nowhere as young as this man. So let's even say this thing happened like five or two years ago. So definitely, he's not even as young as this man they are seeing. So because they are not current with... Um, the news around the world that is why they, they felt for him well that's what i saw on the internet i just decided to share with you guys i'd like to 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 know what you guys think about this video drop a comment in the comment section let's know what you think also share this video with people let them get to know what is happening and um that's gonna be all for today's video i'll see you guys in my next video but before then if you are not subscribed to my channel do me a favor by subscribing that's the only way you can support my channel and also, if you want to support me personally, check in the description box. You're going to see my PayPal account. You can support me through there also. You're going to see my Twitter account. If you want to communicate with me, you can also communicate with me through my Twitter account. That's going to be all. Bye. Mr. Bin, Bin, Bin.